Welcome to Python on Android. If you've ever wanted to learn Python programming using only your Android phone, you're in the right place. In this video, I'll show you what PyDroid 3 is. First, open the Google Play Store. Search for PyDroid 3. You'll see an app with a yellow icon in the Python logo. Tap, install, and wait for it to finish. Once it's done, open the app and you're ready to write your first line of Python. Once you open PyDroid 3 for the first time, you'll see a welcome screen. Just tap, continue, to proceed. Next, you'll be asked to choose a few options based on your preferences. Don't worry, you can always change them later. Feel free to pick the default settings, or customize them as you like. You'll also see an offer for the premium version of PyDroid 3. It's optional, the free version works perfectly fine for learning and running Python scripts. Now that you're inside the app, let's take a quick look at the main interface. At the top, you have your editor, where you'll write Python code. There's also a small menu icon that lets you access the app settings if you ever want to change them. To install external libraries like Colorama, you'll need to use the built-in terminal. Just tap the three-dot menu, then choose Terminal. This is where you can run pip commands, just like on a real computer. Now type the following command to install Colorama greater than pip install colorama. Wait a few seconds, and it'll be ready to use in your scripts. Now it's time to write the code. Just type or paste the script inside the editor, like we did here. You'll notice the title says, Python on Android. That's our channel name, added to make it more fun and personal. Once you're ready, Tap the yellow play button at the bottom right corner of the screen to run your program. And there it is, Party Popper. You should see a colorful welcome message, asking for your name, and responding with a custom message using your input. This is your first interactive Python script, written and executed directly from your phone. If this was helpful, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon bell. We've got many more amazing scripts, tools, and real mobile projects coming your way. This is just the beginning and we're coding everything on Android. To save your script, tap the three dots, choose, save as, and give it a name, that's it. 